Today was a truly special day down in Ripon as the Red Hawks played in their regular season finale and it was possibly the last game for head coach Ron Ernst. The Red Hawks have a million different scenarios where they can make the playoffs, but it was for sure the last regular season game for the head coach. It was also senior day, so an awesome day all around at Ingalls Field. Of course, Coach Ernst had to lead the team onto the field as they took on Lawrence. Let's see if the Red Hawks could send them out with the win. Lawrence has to punt on the very first possession. The punter bobbles the snap. He tries to kick it off the ground. It's going to be taken back for a touchdown. Zach Bunders with the scoop and score. And then after a great punt return for the Red Hawks, two plays later, a short passing touchdown. Jared Zybert to Cormac Madigan. Too easy. They go up 14 to zero. Still in the first quarter. Connor Ramage gets a short handoff. And through all the ruckus, he's eventually going to get in 21 to nothing. And now a quick forward pass from Zyber to Mike Burke, and he's going to get around the end using that speed to pass the pylon for a touchdown. 28 to nothing, it's still early in the second quarter. And the Red Hawks just running away with it. Still in the first half, Zybert to Kaipo Megzayo, dropping that one in the bucket. What a dime from Zybert. This game would be one Lawrence would like to erase from their history books, folks. Rippin wins 82 to zero. And with that win, Rippin earned a share of their first Midwest Conference Championship in 21 years. So if this is it for Coach Ernst, what a way to go out. Here he is after the game. If you have one thing you want to say to the Ripon community, players, everybody who's ever been involved in this program, what do you what do you have to say? Well, I think the big thing is thank you very much. They they mean so much to me, more than they'll ever realize. You know, I've been thanked by players, but I don't think they realize how much they have blessed me and how much they mean to me. Uh, just seeing alums that I haven't seen here for I've got a kid here and I didn't know he was here from my very first high school coaching job in 1980, Osceola, Nebraska, small town of about a thousand people, and he was here. And it's just like, wow, you know, it's just like, so much that they've done for me is just unbelievable. And uh, I consider myself very, very lucky. And we will see if Rippin makes the playoffs, but what a career for Coach Ernst.